have a child in Dallas ISD, make sure you're checking the right calendar because today might be their first day of school. Yeah, the district is using three different start dates this year to help with student learning. Yeah, good idea. So Susan Bruner is live outside H.I. Holland Elementary School at Lisbon. So one of those schools starting early, so, so early this year. It really is. Good morning, Kara and Mark. Yes, the bell will ring here at H.I. Holland Elementary later this morning. It's one of five schools uh, welcoming back students in the Dallas ISD as part of the school day redesign calendar. So the district has three different school year calendars that it's starting off with for the first start of the year and it's to help student learning during the pandemic. So take a look at this next Monday. 41 schools will actually go back to school on the intercession calendar. Then the following Monday, that's August 16th, a majority of campuses will start school on a base calendar. While many parents and students are excited for the school year, some are also feeling a little nervous about it, about sending their children back as COVID-19 and the Delta variant is at risk. But one upcoming fourth grader tells WFAA while he he plans to stay safe. He's looking forward to seeing his friends and teachers. It's just because maybe things might be a little bit harder, a little bit more challenging. So here are a few things parents and students need to know about back to school safety. So students will be sitting three feet apart and will be asked to wash their hands regularly. Masks are optional, but they are recommended. Now, every campus will have mask and hand sanitizer there. They will also undergo enhanced cleaning and ventilation and will also be disinfected weekly. Coming up at 7 o'clock this morning, uh, Superintendent Michael Inaosa will actually do a walkthrough of the school, do a meet and greet with teachers and students in the classrooms. If you need more information about the new back to school year calendars, there's three of them again. You can find that on the district's website. I'll also post those links onto Facebook and Twitter. Back to you.